Hey, this is Gerald with Bass Kicking Adventures. I just wanted to show you this uh, Cayman boat that I got a few days ago. And I took it out the next day after I got it. And I had never been in one of these before and absolutely loved it. And I'm just going to give you a walk around, uh, show you the features of the boat, and tell you what I liked about it and tell you what I didn't like about it which I can already tell you, there's nothing I didn't like about it. But let me get started here. So this is the Cayman 9.8, nine feet, eight inches, one man boat, has foot controlled trolling motor, uh, 54 pound thrust. Here is the Coast Guard sticker. Here's where the battery goes. This is where the depth fish finder, that's the hookups for it. And this is the hookups for the battery. All right, these are the foot controls for the trolling motor. Cable driven, they work great. All right, I have two fold down cleats one on each side. I have two rod holders. Those came in really handy. Got one on each side. This little depth fish finder made by Humminbird. That thing worked like a champ. Loved it. It's got a good size live well. Got the transducer mounted in there. Got an extra prop for the trolling motor. Uh, very comfortable. Fold down padded seat. The seat sits on a little platform, which I like. I'm not sitting right on the floor, so I like that. And it's got a track on it where you can move it forward and backwards, which I really like. Cayman Boats out of Florence, South Carolina. Got drain plug back here in the back. Then here you have your digital forward and reverse that thing worked like a champ loved it that little rod tip protector that was nice too you get down in some tight waters some trees some tree branches and stuff that's nice to have now this battery cable right here it runs into the digital control and then of course runs back to the motor. Uh, later today, I'm gonna hide all that where it can't be seen. So for the things that I really like about the boat is the stability of the boat. I grew up fishing in uh, small water, creeks, rivers, farm ponds, so, you know, I fished out of a lot of small boats, creek boats, warrior boats, one-man bass hunters, all that stuff. This one right here has every feature that I wanted. You can get into the shallow places quietly. Uh, you have the st stability that I wanted. I'm 230 pounds, and I was standing up fishing out of this boat with no problem. The digital motor control, absolutely perfect. So like I said at the beginning, uh, there's a lot of positives about this boat. And it's just a beautiful boat. I love that camo color. A lot of positives about this boat. Honestly, I have nothing at all negative to say about this boat. And like I said, I've got, I've got a lot of experience fishing out of these kind of boats matter of fact my daughter who is part of this channel Aubrey 
that's our creek boat right there and it was mine uh before i got the cayman that's what i was fishing out of and when i got the cayman i gave it to aubrey and she fished out of that the first time the other day and she loved it so it's nothing against creek boats or warrior boats bass hunter boats they're all good boats but just you know for me this is the boat for me super well made um so cayman 9.8 highly recommend this boat it doesn't matter if you're a big man or a small man or you know a teenager you know it, it doesn't matter this boat will fit everybody all right well i appreciate you watching hope you enjoyed the video and if you're looking for a small boat don't think twice get you a cayman you'll love it please hit the subscribe button hit the like button this is bass kicking adventures have more videos coming out soon have a good day